Well, a very good morning to you. This actually is what it's all about. On here is written the word wizard. Maybe it should be genius, because this is Brian Lara's bat. This is the one with which, at the moment, he is 313 not out. I have to say, I wish it was me, but it's him. He's on the threshold of retaking that world record, which he set here 10 years ago on this very same ground. The way he played yesterday was one of the best displays I've ever seen of batting. Yeah. And I hope it continues today for the crowd and yeah. for Brian Lara. Yeah. Well, I've got a nasty feeling he's going to need this pretty soon. Yeah, we better give it to him. Very good luck to you. Thank good luck, Brian. Good luck. There's a gap there, and Lara's found it. Flicked away for four. Super shots. One bounce and four. Oh, he's looking for the second. Butcher is the man coming in from deep mid wicket. He can't get there in time. So, Brian Lara reaches another milestone. 350 not out. And there he goes, right where the fielder came from. That's four. That's gone a long, long way. It's gone into the Sevillian Richards Pavilion for six. And it draws a Brian Lara level with the current other world record holder, Matthew Hayden. That's the way to do it. Down the wicket, and I think that's what he wanted to do. And he's done it, he's equaled the record. The England team appreciate this amazing achievement. One more, and Brian Lara, on the same ground that he set the record before Matthew Hayden broke it, will retain the record of Highest run scorer in Test cricket ever. Hitmath, Michael Vaughan brings the field in. I have a feeling I know where this might be going, Bish. There it is. The world record has fallen once again to Brian Charles Lara of Trinidad and Tobago and the West Indies. The second time in his career that he's broken this record. And what a moment of history this is, a repeat performance. Ten years ago, he set it, and he's done it again at the very ground. The card of honour, he received it ten years ago. Matthew Hayden had one last October. And now Brian Lauer reclaims his rightful place. Brian, David Bowen has him. Brian, that's absolutely magnificent. Congratulations. Thanks very much, David. It's... It's hard to believe, you know, and um, Matthew Hayden must have played well against Zimbabwe. It doesn't matter who you play against, they scored that amount of runs. I've scored it 10 years ago and I didn't know what it was like, but this time around, it's really, really tiring, you know, and, um, you know, it's amazed to be here again. Batty to Lara. There goes the sweep, there it is. Perhaps the most significant single ever in the history of Test Match cricket. Brian Charles Lara becomes the first man in the history of the game to register a score of 400. 582 deliveries, 776 minutes with 43 fours and four sixes. A remarkable human being.